All right, welcome back to my conversation only on KAIL TV, my Central Valley. Austin Reed with you on this Thursday. Thank you so much for joining us. Man, we've had a fantastic show. We talked a little bit about dating and love and then Exeter. Well, now we have a special treat for you as well. How about give it up, my studio audience, for Dope Barber Shop? This is Vince Cortez, this is Christian, and this is Cyrus. Good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks, Thanks. for coming in. We're Thanks doing a live us. haircut as we talk about Dope Barber Shop. So take it away, Vince. Well, thanks. Thanks for having us. Uh, yeah, we're, we're here going to do a live haircut. And uh, Christian is actually the uh, champion belt holder right now for the Central Valley in the Freshest Fade. So at the Barber Battle that was just about a month ago, he won the Freshest Fade. So that's why we wanted to come on here and have him uh, show off his, his talent a little bit. This is great. You never know what you're going to see on my conversation. <laughs> how long has Dope Barber Shop, how long have you guys been, been in business for? We, uh, our first day, uh, we was, it was on December 1st is when we just opened up. So we've been open for about two to three months now. Very cool, very cool. What was the idea? Um, I've always, I've been a barber for a long time and I always wanted my own shop and uh, so that started happening and uh, I wanted to do more of a concept and then rather than doing Vince Cortez barber shop, yeah. uh, we wanted something that was really catchy and that's something that uh, the barber culture uh, kind of can uh, relate to and every time that you see a, a nice cut, the word that comes to mind is dope. So everybody says that's a dope cut. So I was like, we need to be a dope barber shop. I have used that word before. <laughs> right? I don't know if I'm officially cool to use that word. Word, but no, uh, you totally you are. Uh, I love your shirt too. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, all right, um, you've got a couple events too coming up. Yeah, we are sponsoring um, the big fight that's happening on March 10th at Tachi Palace. Um, we're the only barbershop that's going to be out there. We're going to be cutting some of the uh, fighters' hair. Um, and then April 27th, I believe, is. Um, Grizzly Fest, and it's a big outdoor concert that's going to be at Chuck Chansey Park. We're also going to be cutting some of the uh, talents hair there. Uh, E40, um, I believe, uh, Faishan, Loopy Fiasco, Revolution, all of them. So we'll Those be out there and names. yeah, come out and see us. Very good, very good. All right, let's talk a little bit about what he's doing right now. Yeah, I think he's doing a fade. I think a skin fade on on Cyrus here. Um, probably a specialty. Uh, like I said, he's the uh, the champion belt holder right now in the whole Central Valley. No. For, for fading for, for men, um, what are some of the things that you have to watch out for? Um, just as far as it's got to be a clean, clean fade. You don't want to see any kind of lines, um, any kind of dark spots. And uh, Christian's probably one of our best guys there at, at the shop doing that. How'd you find Christian? Um, I recruited him, actually, uh -huh. yeah. So uh, we were at the barber battle. I saw that he won. And I was like, man, you got to come work for me. And so, so uh, it kind of worked out to where he, he was available to come over to the shop. And uh, as I say, it's history. And now, and now he's he's making making guys in the Fresno area look that much better. Absolutely. Is it is it important to get a really good haircut for Absol men? Absolutely. Why? Absolutely. Men, I mean, men want to be pampered just like women, too. So, I mean, the, the better you feel about your cut, the better you're going to feel out in public. So um, that's a big thing for us is we want to make you walk out of our barbershop feeling the best that you can. Now, uh, as far as tools, what are some of the tools that, that Christian uses? Um, he's using right now, uh, actually he's using a uh, cordless, uh, is that a wall? Yeah, well, it's a wall magic. So um, he's, he, we use Andes, we use wall, we use trimmers, uh, we use shavers. We're, we're a full-blown barbershop, so we do the hot towel shaves. Uh, the big thing right now is a black mass facial. Uh, we put this uh, black goop all over your face. It hardens, and then when we rip it off, it takes all the pores out. Makes you feel uh, your skin feel real soft and clean. Um, so, I mean, we're a full-service barbershop. We're an old-school kind of feel, but with a modern, trendy kind of twist. So you've been around, like you said, since December 1st, mm -hmm. and now, how long have you, would you consider yourself uh, a barber for? I've been a barber, well, not a licensed barber, but I've been a barber pretty much since, you know, high school, cutting uh -huh. my friend's hairs in the garage and all that stuff, so, and then I decided uh, that, you know, I wanted to follow my passion and get my license, and I did that, and it's been about six, seven years now okay. since I've been licensed. So, I mean, seeing what you're accomplishing in Fresno with Dope Barber Shop and, and the customers, your customers, what are they saying? We, we're getting a big, uh, a big feedback from, I mean, a lot, of, a lot of people that are coming in. I mean, we, we've been on 
I mean, your show, we've been on Channel 24 twice now. Um, we're being promoted all over the valley as far as doing these big events. So um, it's kind of big, a whirlwind of stuff that's happening, but um, and it, it, it's really good, though. You know, we, we love it. It's, it's a lot of good promotion for us. We, we've got just a couple minutes left. Looking at my head shape, right? If there's, I wanted... there's nothing we can do for you. I'm sorry. Ah, okay, I'm walking <laughs> off. Goodbye. Uh, I'm no. kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> if I... I mean, I've kind of the, my hairstyle. I used to, I used to do fades when it, when, but right now I'm I'm getting older and I feel like eh, my hair is just. We do. All, I don't know. What What do you think? We Could do, do everything across the spectrum. We do uh, gentlemen's cuts all the way down to the new trendy kind of hip cuts that the kids are doing. But um, the classic comb over is back. Everybody's doing a comb over that right now. What, That's kind right. of what you have a little bit okay. right now. And we okay. do, you know, a real keep it real tight on the sides and then do the classic comb over and it just looks really clean. And, and uh, I mean, you can wear it, you know, to a business meeting or you can wear it going out to the club at night. So now with Cyrus, um, what would you consider his hairstyle before? Be, before the haircut that you're doing. Well, now. I mean, he's what he's same? yeah. It's he's Gonna doing he's doing a classic fade, and he's okay. got kind of the Caesar cut where you you know you do cut the front and uh, mm -hmm. line everything up. A lot of uh, basketball players do. Like when I was playing basketball, it was very important for me to uh, my hair was much shorter, but you know <laughs> I was younger, wow. and so I could do that. I feel like I'm losing my hair now, but uh, well, not not as bad as some people. <laughs> but um, you know, I, I think that in the front right you gotta line it up perfectly i was always big on that right right yeah that's a big thing right now too is i mean doing, that, that's perfect yeah doing the full lineup is is uh is is really trendy right now and and on the side and then on the sides obviously and um what about facial hair do, do you guys work on yeah facial like hair i said too? we're we're a full stop shop so okay. we do uh full beards we do beard lineups um uh, we do anything, anything that you can think of that's gonna that you're gonna find in a barbershop, You're gonna get it dope. Okay, very good. All right, we're gonna wrap up. As so, what what is he doing now? As as we're wrapping, he's up? actually doing a lineup on him. So he's, we okay. call that a box out. So he's he's boxing out uh, the sides, and he's gonna just fully line up the front. And then that'll pretty much, and then he'll be he'll be set. He'll be dope. He'll be dope. He'll be dope, man. You, you should, are you doing the hashtag dope on like Instagram? You Absolutely. were telling me that, right? Absolutely, yeah. You can find us on Instagram at, at Dope Barbershop Fresno, uh, on Facebook as well. Same thing. We do have a website at dopebarbershopfresno.com. And then um, you could see all the work that we do. Um, you could see pictures of the shop. Um, but yeah, you'll be able to see Christian's cuts, my cuts, anybody that works in there. We have eight barbers in there right now, so we're fully staffed. So I, I, we're on, we're at 7773 North okay. First Street. First and knees is the cross streets. So yeah, we, we, we're asking everybody, come on down, see what we can do. I guarantee we're gonna be the best shop in Fresno. And, and um, talk about the events again. And uh, we're doing uh, March, 10th, March 10th, Tacky Palace will be out there. We'll have a booth out there. We'll be cutting the fighters out there. And then April 27th will be Grizzly Fest. We'll be out at Chuck Chansey Park. Chuck Chansey Park. All right, my studio audience, give it up for Vince Cortez from Dope Barbershop. We got Cyrus and Christian. Christian, again, one of the, the best stylists he is. in Central California. So check him out, Dope Barbershop in Fresno. All right, you're watching my conversation right here on KAIL. We'll be back with much more right after this. Stick around.